Good morning. Welcome to PHP tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how to get the selected value from the list box control in PHP. The following steps are used to implement this program. Step 1. Create HTML program tutorial.htm. In this program, we use the select tag to create the list box control and option tag is used to add values into the list box control. Step 3. Create the PHP program tutorial.php. Step 4. Run the HTML program. Let's start. First, I will start the editor like Notepad. Set the language stm and write the basic HTML program structure and move the cursor into the body type. Here, I create the HTML form with the help of form tag form name equals to form1 method equals to post and action equal to q12.php after this I set a caption like select a program after this, I change the line with the help of br tag. After this, I start the select tag. Select tag is used to create list box in HTML. Select name equal to list one. You can assign any name. And next important attribute is size. Size attribute determine the height of list box control. For example, 4, I close the select tag, select. Now, I add the values into the list box control. This work is done with the help of option tag, option, value, value equals to BCA and caption is this here program and finally I close the option tag here I just copy this code paste it and paste it now I change the value MCA MCA PG DCA PG DCA after this, I change the line with the help of br tag and finally I create submit button with the help of input tag. Input name equals to s1, type equals to submit and value equal to show. In this program you can see here select tag is used to create the list box control and option tag is used to add value into the list box control. When the user click on submit button, q12.php file will execute. When the user select any value like bca, mca, this value automatically is stored into the variable list1. I save this file, click on file, save. This file must be saved into the stdocs folder. A name is q12.htm. Click on save. After creating HTML file, we must create its PHP file, q12.php. To create this file, click on file, new, set the language, PHP. I start the PHP tag, PHP, and close the PHP tag. In this tag, I first declare a variable like dollar $p equals to dollar underscore post. In this array, I pass the name of list box control which is list1 and semicolon. Now, I call the echo function echo. Here, I pass the name of 
dollar p variable and semicolon after creating this file click on file and save this file also must be saved into the astrodocs folder and file name is tute12.php click on save now i minimize the id start the xamp click on start and start and start minimize it open the web browser here i type the http colon slash slash local host and html program name which is 212.htm our interface is display here i select the bc program click on show you can see the value display here mc program click on show pgdc program click on show click on back i reload my page now i did not select any value and click on show you can see here a warning message display here to resolve this issue open the editor and write a condition here if is set and dollar underscore post pass the name of list box control which is list one after this start the curly braces else and display warning message here like echo please select please select it control after this save the file file save open the web browser reload the page bca show i again reload my page and show here you can see the warning message is display here in this tutorial you have learned how to handle or get value from the list box control if you like this video kindly subscribe to my channel share this video on facebook twitter blogger and in your whatsapp group if you have any doubts regarding this video kindly contact us by using given email address or mobile number thank you for watching my video